What's up everybody, it's Lawrence again. Sorry for the delay in terms of getting you guys new content because I was on vacation in Hawaii, Vietnam, and Hong Kong. Had a wonderful time, but we have to get back into the sneaker reviews. So while I was away, uh, right before I left, I was on a plane and I ordered this right before takeoff. And uh, the takeoff piece of this is obviously super important because we, today we are gonna be reviewing the Vans X NASA Skate High MTE. So let's start with the upper like we always do. You can see that the predominant piece of the upper is done in a white leather. This is a premium version of Vans leather, which actually just means it goes from shitty quality to leather to okay quality leather. Uh, so it's it's supple, it's pretty soft, it's pretty easy to squish onto. Um, not the most high quality leather, and you can tell that right away, but it's definitely not bad. In addition to that, there is a bunch of contrast stitching all throughout the shoe. Uh, what's cool is on the lateral side of the shoe, you can actually still see that there is the Vans signature logo over here with a piece of leather still stitched onto it. The other predominant piece that you're gonna see on the lateral side is going to be a patch that's in Velcro. So you can actually take this off. Um, you can probably hear it right now, and you can see that it comes right off, and that is an orange underlay on the bottom. Um, so there's another piece that also has Velcro on top of it, which is on the tongue itself, and there's a little Vans logo here. I actually think I'm gonna find something to swap it out with. Uh, if you have any ideas or comments on what you think I should swap it out with, definitely leave it in the comments below. Going to the top of the shoe, you're going to see oval style lacing done in a black, and then the eyelets over here are also done in a plastic, which is also black. What is kind of cool is underneath over here, if you can see that, there is a pattern uh, done in a nylon in the middle. On the back of the shoe, you're going to see the NASA slogan, the benefit of for all, which kind of goes over here. I think that's a really cool touch, and you have your official Vans logo on the very back in the red, the iconic piece of that. Uh, the cooler part about the upper is the exposed foam that you can see all the way on the top over here, and then also some exposed foam over here, as well as over here on the medial side. So I do want to show you the other shoe as well. So on the other shoe, instead of having the, the one patch that's removable, you actually have a NASA patch over here that is not removable. And then on the flip side, you also have a, an astronaut symbol over here. Going to the midsole, this is the part of the shoe that I absolutely love. Uh, I don't know what it is, but but it just looks like a space shoe. And so if, instead of the, the typical kind of Vans um, outer over here on the midsole, you're gonna see something that has ribbing on it in the very front as well as the back of it. On the bottom of the shoe, you're going to see a pattern that is done in different colors uh, as well, and that is for grip purposes. Um, I personally think Vans did one mishap on the shoe. I love the design in general, but I really wish that they actually made the bottom of the shoe look like a lunar shoe when you step onto a moon and, and having that space boot look on the bottom of the shoe would be amazing. I think most of us would be more than happy to give away some of the traction so that we could have that look in the snow, which would be sweet during the winter time. On the inside of the shoe, you're going to see a sock liner uh, with, with the pull tab attached to it. The bottom of the shoe, which is where the insole is, has a spaceship uh, and the schematics of a spaceship in it with a Vans red logo on there as well. And then the this part is something that's gonna be super important to talk about. The tongue is really, really hard. Um, you can actually hear a crunch, which I think is interesting. Overall, uh, the last part of the shoe, this is an MTE version of the Skate High. And ultimately what that means is the leather itself is waterproof. And so you can actually wear this into most conditions and your feet will actually stay dry, which is pretty sweet. Um, the other piece of that is that there is a liner on the inside as well to keep the water out. Um, and finally, the, the last bit because of that means that it's actually not that breathable. Um, the last thing about MTE versions of Skate Highs is that instead of using kind of the typical van sole, it actually has an ultra cush sole, which gives it a lot more cushioning when you're walking, which makes it a much more comfortable shoe than your typical vans. So what are my thoughts on this shoe? I absolutely love this collab. There is nothing more that I love. Uh, when I saw the different pairs, there's a nice orange pair that's a, that's a low. There's a white pair that's also a low. This was by far my favorite in, in a white with a, uh, with, with a skate high. And it just, it just really hits it out of the ballpark. It's a simple shoe, but yet it has all the undertones of a NASA shoe in it. And I, I love the logo. And I don't know if anyone else has this problem. 
is this tongue. Like I said earlier, it's extremely hard. And whenever I try to walk, for whatever reason, it's just my right ankle, but on the inside ankle, um, it hits some weird part of the tongue and it makes it hurt. I'm hoping that over time this is gonna break in and it won't affect it that much, but from a comfort level perspective, that is my one main gripe. I can't wear it too long for that reason. Uh, but I've been actually rocking these for, I've been back on vacation for about three days and I've rocked them two out of the last three. I absolutely love them and so you know, I hope others will as well. In terms of comfort, I would say that this is actually a pretty comfortable shoe. It's, it's a lot better than I expected. I don't usually like Vans, but the Ultra Kush technology that's inside here, um, that's different from the typical old school's Vans is, is, is pretty good. And I say there's really not much of a major complaint. It is definitely a heavy shoe, but I, you know, it is what it is. I don't expect much technology out of Vans. Finally, I would like to talk about sizing. From a sizing perspective, I would say that these run a little bit long, but not drastically long. So I did go true to size on these and they're totally fine, but I probably could have also done half size down and uh, that would have also worked well and just be a little bit more snug. And that's it guys. This is the Vans X NASA collaboration of the Skate High MTE. Until next time, peace.